Jugglies, it's Shell here from Completely Shell and I'm back today to do an unboxing for you. I wasn't due to do a video today as I've already got one that I was planning on putting online but I went to my post box this morning and one of my subscription boxes has arrived so I thought I would come on and do a video. Anyone that's watched my previous video and anyone that knows me will know a massive fact about me is that I am very impatient. So I thought I would come on and do it today so that I don't have to wait and you can see what I've got. So what I've got for you today is something a little bit different. It's not beauty and it's not makeup. Um, it's actually a wax melt subscription box. So this is from Flamingo Candles. I love having a lovely smelly, nice smelly house. Um, and always have candles and I burn wax melts quite regularly, normally Yankee candle ones, but I wanted to try a different brand and one that's 100% um, eco-friendly and vegan and I know is cruelty free, so I thought I would do some research. <coughs> Excuse me. So while I was doing my research, I found Flamingo candles and their candles look amazing, their reviews are really good. Um, their Instagram was really good and I'd seen that they'd been at a couple of vegan trade shows as well so I signed up to the box last month and I got my first subscription last month so it's called the Melt Crowd it's £10 a month um, and the value of the box is £18.95 so you're getting a good save in there anyway so let's open it because I can't wait anymore so this is the box that you get it in so it's really good because it's thin and so it fits through your letterbox. So I love my subscription boxes but I do work full time during the week so it can make it really difficult for me because I have to, if I miss it or my neighbour's not in, I have to pop to the post office and there's no parking and it's just a nightmare. So this is brilliant because it fits in your letterbox. And each month there is a theme and this theme this month is Dare to Dream. So. It already smells amazing. So let's see what's in it. So it comes like this. And you get this little card. And on the back of the card, it tells you what the scents are that you've got in it. So it looks very good. So again, it's a nice little sticker and wrap in. I'm so excited that I'll just rip it. Oh, look. Oh, I got a little key ring in it. How exciting is that? So it says, always look on the pink side of life. How cute is that little gift that came in it? And that's, that's not, not normal. So you normally get eight wax melts. But I got a free key ring. So I'm very happy. Thank you, Flamingo Candles. Um, so here, as you can see, they all look the same colour. So I'll show you one up close so you can see. So they're quite big actually. In your first month subscription, for no extra cost, you get a wax, uh, an oil burner. Um, don't make the same mistake that I did. It's a lovely wax burner, but I put a whole one of these in, in my first month, which my husband thought was rather funny because it then spilled over the edges. <laughs> so now I use half of one of these at a time and it still smells amazing and can still make your whole house smell. And also, obviously, then you're keeping hold of them so they last even longer. So I have got Cheesecake Crunch. And it smells just like cheesecake. So that's really nice. What else have we got? We have got Peaches and Cream. That smells amazing. Literally smells like peaches and cream. <sighs> really peachy. So that's nice. Pineapple and coconut. Smells exactly like pineapple and coconut, funnily enough. But again, it's going to make your house smell really, I think, summery. So now we're past the Christmas period in the new year. It'd be quite nice to have a house that smells summery instead. I have got all oh, unicorn dreams and that's really fresh fruity smell again a really summery smell I like that too 
I have got oh, vanilla pod. I wonder what this is going to smell of. Vanilla. That's very vanilla-y is the only way I can describe it because it is vanilla -y. And here I've got raspberry sangria. That smells amazing. Raspberry is one of my favourite smells actually. And it does smell like raspberry it's always really good they do smell i find that the ones that i've tried so far do smell exactly like the smell here just a bit stronger so it's definitely worth giving them a go if you're not having a nice smelling house so this one's white lilac and rhubarb that one's more rhubarby <laughs> so it's still fruity <laughs> not quite as fruity as the others that's probably my least favourite one at the minute, but it might be different once I um, burn it. And finally, black pepper. Now, I'm not sure I want to sniff this one. I'm not a massive fan of pepper. My husband likes it. And he'll he'll definitely want to burn this, but... I don't know. It smells quite nice. It smells like men's aftershave is what this reminds me of. But really nice men's aftershave so i would burn that because my house is not nice but maybe not when my husband's here but not here either because you might think i've had men in the house not that he'd mind he's not jealous or anything so i'm really happy again they all seem really good scents and as i say here you get your little card with the information on and you get a code every month from flamingo candles that gives you a 20 percent discount off for the month so if I want to order any full size flamingo candles, I'll get 20% off. Um, as I say, they, they're amazing. I was gonna show you the um, wax burner, but I forgot, but it is just a white, normal oil burner that you could buy. Um, and you just put obviously the wax in the top and your tea light candle underneath, and then it smells really nice. They are made from eco soya, soy wax i believe so they are vegan and they're cruelty free and they're eco-friendly which is really important um and they burn at a, a less hot level so they're cooler so if you've got children or animals or i've got chi uh, i haven't got children i've got animals um then you worry about it less because you're less likely to burn yourself i have spilt mine a few times and i haven't burnt myself because i am rather clumsy so that's this month january melt crowd dare to dream what i wanted to do just very quickly was just show you last month i'm not going to go through all the um wax melts but i will tell you the smells that i had which were amazing so the theme last year was merry kitchmas and all the scents on the back show you they're all in different colors all christmas themed and so far, all I haven't used them all yet, but they all smell amazing. So there was ginger set, gingerbread scent melt, a Christmas pudding vodka, peppermint swirls, and that's what I've got burning in my house at the moment, and it genuinely smells really pepperminty, and it's lovely. Um, mulled wine and berries, that was the yellow one, so I kind of struggled to read that one a little bit. Chocolate orange, smells amazing, I've burnt that one too. Cranberry and licorice. I've burnt recently, again, really licorice smell. And if you like licorice, it smells amazing. Snowberry and mistletoe, which was um, a really nice scent. I haven't burnt that yet. It'll be interesting to see what that smells like. And cinnamon buns. Now, again, cinnamon is one of my least favourite things in the world. I don't really like the smell, but my husband really likes it. So we did burn that. And that was the first one we burnt. Um, and it was very cinnamony. So again, I was really happy with it. I will be putting pictures of this on my blog and on my Instagram. Um, if you like this video, I will be doing more unboxings and I'm going to be doing a video on my daily skincare. So what products I use, obviously they're all vegan and cruelty free. Um, so if you'd like to see that, please subscribe to my channel and click the little bell so you get a notification to say that I have posted a new video and also follow me on Instagram because I'm always posting on Instagram and I will always post when I've got a new video up. Um, I will link my blog and my Instagram in the message section below. If you've got any comments please let me know and I will always come back to you. Thanks and I will speak to you soon. Take care guys. Bye.